Hello everybody, my name is Isis Daniel and I am the Millennial Psalm. And today we are here for Millennial Points. Ah! Yes, you guys, every Wednesday I am right here on YouTube testing out some wine products for you. So if you watch me weekly and you have a product that you would like me to try, please make sure that you mention it in the comments below. But most importantly, make sure that you are liking, subscribing, following, turning on all your notifications, honey, okay? Because we are here weekly and we have a weekly giveaway. Last week, we were a little slow on the uptake <laughs> and I still have my um, gift from last week, which was the wine set. If you guys participate, you can still get that prize before Christmas. So make sure that you let me know if you're interested by doing all the steps from last week's instructions on my Instagram, all right? So make sure you do that because we also have another two whams of um, a giveaway. So let's go ahead and get into this week's Millennial Points. All right, you guys. So breaking down how everything is done, we have three categories, okay? We have first, the packaging, then cost, then functionality. Each category gets a total of five, 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 five points, okay? So if you are a lucky winner, if you just knock out everything out of the park, you get a total of 15. That is the goal for these, you know, these products. But, you know, who's perfect? We'll see one day. But <laughs> today we are going to be using this aerator here. So pretty much everything I, you know, have been using so far has been from Amazon. So if you see this product and you don't win one of the giveaways, I always put in the link, the links below, an easy little link so that you can click and purchase for yourself. Because it's on Amazon, especially if you have Amazon Prime, you could get this within two days. I'm just saying. So make sure that you guys are always stay in tune to what we got. But let me show you guys exactly what we're working with. So we have the Essentials by Nirvana. Okay, so this is an aerator. This is supposed to be super, super fancy. All you got to do is put it in your wine, press a button, and it aerates your wines. From their website, it said that it's, it does up to six, time, uh, six times of aeration. So this is supposed to be close to pretty much decanting your wines for like an hour or so, which is crazy. You know, your wine is trapped in a bottle for however long it was and it needs oxygen to kind of allow the wine to open up so this is what this is supposed to do it's supposed to be easy to use very slick fun little product at your parties that you can talk about so that's what this is all about now let's go ahead and talk about this packaging so the packaging and how I got it wasn't really that great. Um, and I had to take off this big old shipping sticker that was physically on the box. Um, and I just don't like that. Like, you know, I like my packaging to be, I know that it doesn't sound very productive, but I need my box to be in a box. You know, like don't mess up the box with the whole big old shipping stamp on it unless you know it's on the bottom it was like all over the words and so what if like when I took this off I would have messed up the words and couldn't be read the instructions that they have here you know what I mean like it's kind of annoying but it's okay I wasn't crazy about that definitely going to take points off of at least the shipping not a good job you could have done better um yeah so this one is the glossy white glossy white finish um, uh, yeah, so I'm interested in seeing pop of essential of your wine bottle and let the good times flow a fuller, smoother tasting glass of wine with the push of a button. Okay. So the, this is supposed to just be, boop, that's it. So let's go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and open this cause I haven't opened it yet. Got my handy dandy wine key. Ooh. All right. Let's open this thing. Okay. Easy to open, just open the sides and voila! Ta -da! Essential. So you have your directions here, which last time I didn't really read the directions and um, realized I missed out on a lot. <laughs> um, so, yep, yeah, this is uh, supposed to be electric. So we have AAA batteries. It's supposed to be like a total of like six batteries you have to put in not really crazy about the amount of batteries you have to use or that you can't just like plug it in and charge it i know that there are some other examples of this same product and i'm not sure if they have um 
you know, they have to all use batteries. I know there's one other one. This price here is like $55.98. I wrote it down. There's another one that's like all black and looks super cool. That's like $80 and another one that's in the hundreds. I know the $80 one, you still have to use batteries. I don't really like batteries. It's, if it's just me, I think everything should be able to plug in and be charged for hours. Just me. I don't know. That's how I feel. Um, but yeah, so let me look over the instructions and then we can get back into what all is in this box. All right, you guys. So all I'm doing is just looking at the instructions here. Already, I'm just like overwhelmed. <laughs> um, there are different people in the world. You have people who read instructions and then you have the people like me who kind of just wings it. And this thing has too many parts. Like I want to just take it out and just use it. And I'm not sure if it's already put together, but this thing looks like I have to do extra stuff and I don't like it. <laughs> oh. Um, so let's just look and see what we got in here. So we have this tube thing, boom, that you're supposed to stick in the bottle of the wine. And then you have the, this thing itself, the aerator. Uh-oh, don't break it. Don't break it. But yeah, so you take this out. And I you think you're supposed to just like do something like this. Like I says, don't break it because you're not reading. But it's supposed to be like that and you just put it in um boom so this is where you get three batteries three batteries triple a okay so i'm gonna go ahead and put the triple a batteries in this thing and this is hope i don't have to like take this thing apart because that's what it looks like i don't want to do that mm. so let's see let's just let's try this thing out real quick i'm gonna put the batteries in i will be right back so we are going to take a moment and just watch me struggle and sing as I try to put in batteries. It's kind of entertaining. So enjoy. So the question of the day is, are you smarter than a narrator? Answer. No. All right, you guys, so we are back. Ow! Okay, so I looked at the instructions a little bit just to make sure I'm not being super lazy. I don't have to take this thing apart like I thought I was going to have to, so thank God. All you have to do, I don't know if you guys can see, um, but there's two little, um, let me see. So there are two little arrows there. How you open it, you just align the arrows, boom, and then you're able to take it off, put the batteries in, and... The, the arrow should be aligned and then you just close it. The arrows aren't aligned and that's how you know it's locked. All right, then you put the tube in the black thingy. All right, amen, God bless. Okay, so that's all you got to really do. Let me, <laughs> okay, fix my light. And then you put it in the bottle. So tomorrow for happy hour, we're gonna be having Han winery they're gonna be joining us super excited to have them on i know i'm like looking at everything because i haven't tasted this wine yet um but this is what i'm gonna be having for happy hour so make sure you guys tune in tomorrow so you can check them out but then let's go ahead and you know put this thing in and see what happens okay i don't know so i just squeeze it in there and that's all that it's supposed to be. It's not supposed to be super hard, but I'm just gonna make sure I did this right. Jesus, I'm nervous. Okay, so I don't have anything right here. So you guys see what I'm doing? The button right on top. And so I'm just going to press. Whoa. That's like super cool. <laughs> I don't know, it just makes me feel like I have like all power in my hand. I wanna do it again. <laughs> wow. This is cool. I like it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I probably should have like tasted the wine before, but whatever. I'm excited. Mmm. It smells really good. Smells like a sexy, mature piano. Mm. Mm. 
Well, this is a great Pinot. <laughs> um, so I will say, in, in honesty, when you have, I should have, I should have tried this wine before the aerator like did its thug bizzle. However, when you have wine that has been trapped in a bottle, you do kind of get that same tightness. You know what I mean? And I'm not getting any of that. So, you know, the fruit is all there. It's, it does. It does taste like it's had a lot of time to aerate, like it's been in a decanter, like it said. So, I don't know. But I'm thinking that they did a good job with this thing. Hmm. It's lit. <laughs> so let's go ahead and rate this thing. Um, I like this product. I like it a lot. I think that it's super cool. I just like pressing the button and I can't wait to use it again. I think they definitely have that going for you. As soon as you use it, you want to like keep pressing the button. Just say it. But packaging wise, I was a little disappointed with how it was shipped to me. Um, and then because, you know, yes, it had the instructions on the back, but I feel like if you put all this time in to like do stuff, maybe I said do stuff, you put all this time in to create such a great background then you ship it and it's like smack it on the back. I just don't like it. Um, and you know, usually when you order from Amazon, they put boxes in boxes all the time. So I don't really know what the deal is with that. But even inside, it was very plain. And it's not bad. It's not like horrible packaging. Like you just didn't care, but it wasn't wild. And because I had that shipping label on like the front and the back, and I had to slowly peel it off so that I can look at the box, I'm giving it a three because I'm just like, seriously, seriously. So there's that. All right, so let's talk about price. Mm -hmm. So the price is $55.98. I don't know if I'm crazy enough about this product to spend $55 on it. I do think it's awesome. I just don't necessarily understand why this would be like $55 other than the fact that it's electronic and it's for wine. If I'm just, if I'm just keeping it a buck with you because last week you know i showed you guys that other product that was like a wine set and it had an electric um uh what is it electric cork remover right it had foil cutter aerator and also a vacuum pump to get all the oxygen out and it was under 30 dollars. so when i'm looking at this thing and it's like 55 <sighs> now do i think it's worth it yeah i mean kind of <laughs> Do I think it's worth the $55? I am not sold. Only reason why I say that is because <sighs> you're pressing a button. And really, that's the only thrill that I'm getting. Yes, it does taste super, super aerated. And I think that that's awesome. And I, you know, comparing to other aerators that I've had, I don't think I would get that same response. So I do think that the price is kind of worth it but at the same time i'm just like but do i need to purchase this item for 55 dollars now i know that's not a lot to a lot of people it's not really a lot to me but still in the quality of price it's kind of like i mean i guess and then you have these the other ones like this is the cheapest one there are others that are like 80 dollars and 100 dollars, and i just don't see myself going out of my way to purchase that when i could just open a bottle of wine and like swirl it or leave it alone for an hour, which I guess you're paying for convenience with this product, but it's kind of like, I guess. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and just give it a three. I do think that it's worth it. If you are the type of person who you have like bottles of wine like Tanat or, you know, even some California cabs that can be really inky or really closed up and need that extra help to open up quicker, I mean, yeah, I think that this will be a great product for you, but at the same time, just open it and leave it on the counter. So I don't know. I'm giving it a three. Y'all tell me what you think. Um, and then as far as functionality, I, I mean, it functions just great. I'll give that a five. <laughs> um, seriously, you know, it's it works. It works just fine uh, as far as that is concerned. So functionality five, I don't really like that I have to use batteries 
So, I don't know. Maybe I'll, I'll give it a four. I take it back. I take it back. I don't like batteries. I think that we live in a day and age where you should be able to charge things. Um, so, yeah, that's me. So, we're going to change that to a four. All right. So, let's go and tally up our points. All right. So, going back down the line, we have the packaging of three. We have price of three. And then functionality, we gave that a four. Total of jump please 10 points boom now again this is just me in my opinion you might get this product and absolutely love it i love it because i like pressing the button and i like how it makes me feel like i have all power in my hand but beyond that the packaging y'all could have done better shipping it just could have done better and then on top of that the price, I'm a little up in the air. And as I try more products, maybe I will feel a different way. But I think that when it comes to wine products and feminine products, and there's just like certain marketing upcharges that I'm just not crazy about. And I think that $55 for this thing, I don't really get it. I think that it's awesome, but I do think that this could have been like $30 personally, especially because you use batteries. And you don't even like provide the batteries. I have to use three AAA batteries out of my own pocket. I just don't know how I feel about that. So that's me and maybe I'll change in the future, but we're gonna go with a solid 10. So if you guys are interested in getting this aerator and you wanna feel like you have all power in your hand, please make sure that you follow all the directions in my Instagram uh, post of my Instagram giveaway post. Now, we do it every week. It's pretty much simple. All you got to do, like this video and comment, letting me know that you liked it. But then also go to my Instagram post, like it, and tag two friends that don't follow me so that I can, you know, we can spread the love and let people know what's going on with the millennial song. But number two, so that you can win. You can go in, you can enter as many times as you like. Doesn't matter. And then as a bonus, share on your page tagging me. Okay, so that's it. I love you guys so much. Tune in tomorrow for Tasting Thursday and also for Tasting Thursday, the Millennial Sound Happy Hour. All right, so I love you guys so much. I'll see you next time. If you haven't done so already, make sure that you like, subscribe, follow, turn on your notifications, and I will see you tomorrow.